Hi, everyone. Welcome to our SOMO Stay at Home session today. We are recognizing our bronze level sponsors for today's session, DeSoto High School, Hobson Lumber, and First State of Farmington. Thank you for supporting our program. I am going to introduce our St. Louis Metro Area athlete, Michael Mormon, and he is describing how to look for expiration dates on your groceries today. Michael, take it away. I said, hi, my name is Michael Mormon, and sorry about last week, my internet was re again, and, uh, but thanks for listening today. Today, like Josh said, we will be talking about expiration dates. Right, so here's what we have. So we learn the difference between open open date code, which gives you a recommendation on how long a certain item will be good for versus a closed code, which tells you when the item was actually manufactured. By learning to read these different codes, you do you better understand how long the food will stay fresh. One, look for a date accompanied by use by, sell by, best by, or freeze by. Check the bottom of the product, so the size of the tanner, lid, or the next to the bottle. So like here, here's a can. Like you know, see, this is the this is the top right, the can right here. Well, here's the bottom I found. Here's the bottom of the can, and it says here, Best Buy January 2020. I always reverse sometimes, <laughs> but um, the numbers are stamped on, on can sometimes be hard to read or find depending on where or place. That's one of them. Um, Expiration dates for food aren't reg regulated by USDA or FDA. They add entirely at the discretion of, of the actual company. There's part of the reason it can be tr so tricky to read these dates and understand how long I your items will be good for. One thing you can tell is good, if food's good, if you if you if you don't smile, it smells bad, or if you see more discoloration, throw it away. If it smells good, looks good, and then been properly stored, it should be still should be safe to eat. If a, if a product, if, a, if you're a retailer, basically, retailer says it's a sell by, that means you can assume, um, basically it says here that on Wiki, well, I said Wiki House, that's, that's my, um, oh, I just had, uh, you know, What's the thing you call you know, um, play rise, but you put like that, that's why I got the like, cow, so that's what I'm going off by credit to them. Uh, you can assume food items vaping for at least seven to days past the so they only some minutes, <laughs> but most mo most retail will be ready to move the stock off the shelves, to make way for new sh shipments. Um, the use by date has more to do with the items quality rather than its safety. Remember, these dates are chosen by the manufacturers, not the FDA, USDA, like I said. Some food products are actually a freeze by, like I mentioned, so that, that consumers can know when to move their goods from the fridge to the freezer so that they don't know, don't have to throw away anything out. Um, and then method two, closing dates. I can't show you an example, but uh, that's what like canned goods. You can look at a code that is made of our numbers and letters combined on just numbers. Well, actually, that was a that is a canned good. I forgot. Uh, the, my it was like use by or sell by or best by. That means it refers to date part was manufactured. So like I said this one here with uh, chili beans. And it said Best Buy, but it means quite. But since this happened to open, so you know it says January 2020, and it was like seven months ago. This is still good. 
since it's not open yet. Um, let's take it here. Main products have been had a closed code as well as open date. If the number you read isn't popular, words like used by or best by, is closing and doesn't refer to whose quality. Match all numeral code with a month, day, and year sentence. If the code you're reading is cut by those six digits, most of like a month, day, year. Some we call it like, it's like, well, it's like M M D D and Y Y. Remember, month means the rest of the month. M M means month. D D to the date and Y to the year. For example, if you said twelve. 15, 18, that means December 15, 2018. The 12th month, the 15th date, and the 18th year. And the last one is that, like, for eggs, it said, you know what? When eggs are in, it's safe to sim eggs within 30 days of three digit code. I meant bring the egg and put in the water. You can test egg, put by putting in a bowl of cold water. If it sinks, it's fresh. If it stands, up to it, it's bad. So here, here's my other examples. I have spicy brown mustard. I don't like mustard. Like say some some numbers it kind of goes it goes away, but you can see here the best buy June 20 uh, June 12 to 2021 last again. But basically you know that's good to twenty twenty one. One wants to be open, then basically mean that means it might not go exactly to twelve twenty twenty one since it will be open. Which is not open yet, but when it won't be open, then I'm just totally sure it won't be exactly save up to begin. Another one I have here. I have. Um, Alpha sauce and this is a used by 02 2022. So that means it's up to two years. But once this is open, that means it might be less than that to, to use by. And then I have corn chips. This, see here, this already been open. And usually the date on here it says, I sent for lunch too. 11 04 20. I mean, it's November the fourth month and the 20. So, you know, this it says up to this year in November. I put the the what's this? It says it's really open. The freshness is again gone each day. So, I mean, it tastes so tastes good. I had some, I say, half a lunch, but it's it, it it's so good. So, and thank you for today. And that's it. Um, thank you for. Uh, listening, and to, to, you know, so you go on websites. Well, I, well, I say I found what you have just putting when that was dot com, but basically, you put how long can keep foods, keep foods, because dot com, you put that how you keep foods dot com or whatever, just any just type related foods, and you see which one is best put website to go. Make sure the website is up to date, and make sure you. You can use one any ones you know, but the mystery's up to date, and and that's it. Uh, thank you, and how much day? Thanks, Michael, and thanks to everyone that joined us today to view this video, and a safe eating to you all.